Welcome back to Let's Play Rebuild! Now last episode, we did something about that evil graveyard, but because the evil graveyard is no, in no way a threat to us, we can ignore it for now. Oh man, 22% risk of death and stuff? We can't have that. Okay, fine. Assign all just for the moment. Okay, first we need to figure out what we're going to do. Alright, since that evil graveyard is no longer a threat, not that it was at any point, we can now judge how much squares we have. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, right here should be the corner of the screen. And we already have... Okay, so, let's see. We've got... I'd say around half the screen fully protected and stuff. There we go. 145 zombies killed. That's ridiculous. Alright, now let's take as many as our so of our soldiers as we can off duty without posing a risk to our fort. A big risk, that is. Alright, this place is still overrun and so far we have done as much as we can and we still can't get rid of that status okay it's only infested right now that is good to know <sighs> stupid dying dogs okay this place is still infested but at least it's not overrun like last time my mouth tastes like pancakes okay it's hazardous we're getting somewhere Okay, that place looks clean. Now we can reclaim it. Meanwhile, let us scout the area nearby. As long as we've scouted the area, we should know the boundaries of the screen. Alright. So... We, let's focus on working our way up to the top of the screen before we start moving to the upper left. I hate when games have a weird rotated screen. It makes it a lot easier to look at, but it makes it hard to describe. Hey look, that zombie's floating off the edge. <laughs> the zombie's kind of meta like that. Oh no, lots of zombies in here. Yeah, we're going to need as much as we can right here, right now. Punch like a drunken driver or stuff like that. Alright, we can't reclaim this area until we take over one of the areas right next to it. So, we're, let's, get, let's just keep punching our way up. Alright, this place is still overrun. We need to make a northern push. We've got to force the zombies out of the city, coming up from the south. Meanwhile, the horde is approaching from the west. I think. I'm using Digimon World 3 directions at this point. Because I've been playing that game for too long. It's like Final Fantasy, except with Digimon. I guess. Alright, McNoodles is safe. Alright. Let's finish our northern push. People are going to kill zombies there while we, while we reclaim the area to the south. Meanwhile, we're going to sucker punch our way from the west. Okay. You can kill zombies here. Then some right there. 
and that should take out their east. No, is that north or east? Okay, I've decided. This area right here is the east. Up there is the north. It is the east, and Juliet is the purity, Mary Sue, classic thingamajig. Yes. That is what Juliet is. Even though she was written to be a tragic character whose stupidity caused her own death, five-year-old girls who have never read Romeo and Juliet still think of her as the most epic princess who ever lived because Taylor Swift said so. And everything we, everything Taylor Swift says is completely true. Am I right, guys? No? Cool. You have brains. Okay, we're in the middle of reclaiming that area. So, we can take over this place using Ben 2D and Bambi Long and people with weird nicknames. Okay, let's put a bar right there because that's honestly quite useless. Um, the gas station, not the bar even though the bar is only slightly less useless. There we go. We can kill some zombies in the suburbs. Now you're a rich zombie living in the suburbs and there's not a whole lot to do. Ugh. I will never stop making bad jokes in this Let's Play. Alright, we can reclaim that area. Scout this area. kill zombies over here even though that seems like a bad idea kill some more zombies over here finish them off kind of a zombie horde zombie ghosts in front of a house all right, we've made no progress over here, so we're going to send in a lot of people. More people than before. Yes, because sending in twice the amount of people will obviously result in twice the amount of success. Stuffs. I think you're watching my slow descent into madness at this point, viewers. Although, at this, though it's really not all that slow anymore. Okay. No, I don't care about those survivors. They can go die in a pit of zombies. That's how much I care. Actually, no, I care a lot. Care a lot. It's a place we all can go wherever we choose it. Or I don't know how that song goes. It's been a while since I watched that rather stupid movie. Scout this area. Hmm. Okay, so let's wait just a little bit. Okay, so let's reclaim over here. And kill zombies over here. <laughs> this is starting to all blend together, viewers, am I right? Well, that's how I feel every time I play this game. It's a great game, but it really starts wearing down on you after a while. Man, those zombies aren't coming with nearly the ferocity. Maybe it has something to do with me taking over their evil graveyard. Nah, that can't be it. All right. Let's end this day. Kill zombies over here. Kill some zombies over there. Fight a lot of zombies. Fight, fight, fight. Chicken for us to no eat. Yeah. Okay, these woods are doing nothing for no one. Or everything for anyone. Maybe that's how the saying works. Oh, we had to cancel our mission? You guys are lazy. What? You're not going anywhere near the zombie horde? 
You guys are stupid. You're stupid uglies. You could have easily taken that zombie horde. Maybe. Probably. But anyway. We're getting close to the edge of the screen. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we've only got about halfway. We're already about halfway there. We just need to keep edging that way. It'll be a slow fight, but we've got to just keep marching across the land, burninating everything in our path and stuff like that. Can we reclaim that area? No, there's still some zombies there. All right, there's a lot of zombies to kill over here. <laughs> Alright, this farm is now safe to take over. Can we scout over here? Yes, we can. Oh, I see a big farm. That'll help. Alright. We're about to uncover the last corner of the screen. I think I decided that it was the north corner, but I stopped caring. Even though I made a Care Bears joke earlier, so everyone's got to care about something or something like that. Okay, let's scout this area. I love how we can just go through areas of extreme infection, because as long as we're not stepping on that square in particular, it's like we're passing right through it. Oh, big food. I mean, food spotted at the big farm? Who would have guessed? Did I just say big food? Wasn't that a character in a stupid Cartoon Network show? One that starred a cabbit bear? Is that what a cat rabbit bear is called? A cabbit bear? I know what a cabbit is, but a cabbit bear? It's like a man bear pig, except I don't want South Park, so... How do I know about that? Okay, we've taken over that farm. I mean, that woods that we're going to turn into a farm. Speaking of which, this farm. Let's kill some zombies over here. And then we are going to slowly edge our way to that big farm, which will be our save point. Ben. I thought Ben drowned, not died by dog bites. Don't worry, Ben. As long as you stay away from water, you'll be all set. Oh, and don't play Majora's Mask. Nothing good will come of that. Alright. I think I see the corner. Okay, if we can just take over that big farm, I'll be set for this episode. Okay. Scout at that police station. Let's scout over here. And here. It helps to scout a lot of areas. As long as you can partially see them, you can scout the area. The reflex is I'm really bad at singing that song. Oh, a dog died. I stopped caring. Oh. I mean, if it was my dog in real life, I would be really broken up. But it's a virtual dog that has nothing to do with anything. It's just to slow down the plot of the game. Have we... Can we see everything now? We can see forever. No, wait, that's when Zalgo invades. Never mind. Yeah, it looks like we can see the entire board. 
Yes, Big Farm Reclaimed. And with that, I will leave you on a cliffhanger.